Hi, I'm Johnny Nettles. I was born in 1933 in Pittsburgh. At an early age, I loved to play football. This led me to play football in high school and college. After I graduated high school, I was invited to the University of Louisville to play football. I had a chance to prove that I was a new quarterback. I was drafted in the ninth round of the NFL draft in 1955 to the Pittsburgh Steelers, but released before the regular season because I was considered great. After I got released, I worked construction and played for a semi-pro team and earned just six stars a game. Then one day in 1956, while playing for the Bloomfield Rams, I got noticed by the Baltimore Colts. I signed to the Baltimore Colts as a backup quarterback to George Shaw. I started when Shaw broke his leg in the fourth game of my rookie season. In 1958, I was recognized as the best quarterback in the NFL because I led in passing yards and completions. I was still playing for the Colts when we beat the Giants in a 1958 championship game. The Giants were a pretty big team in the league, so this was a big deal to NFL fans. Uh, I led my team to Super Bowl three against the Dallas Cowboys, but I only got to play one and a half quarters because of a bruised rib. In 1969, I was recognized as the best quarterback of all time and then the Associated Press Player of the Decade 1960. At the time of my retirement, I held five NFL passing records. That's why I was named the Golden Arm. In my career, I completed a minimum of one touchdown per game. In my life off the field, I married Orthy Jean Hall. We had five kids together. After we divorced, I married Sandra Lemons and we had three kids together. I died of a heart attack in 2002.